If there's anything to be learned from watching previous videos, it's that Yandere Simulator is known to have tons of removed content. In the second part of this mini-series, we'll be going over more removed content from Yandere Simulator. Make sure to go watch part 1 if you haven't already. So, let's get into it. Let's start off with removed controls. Prior to the June 1st, 2016 build, pressing the G button would cause Midori Gurin to go to the rooftop for her event. This obviously no longer works as this function was removed in the previously mentioned build. Along with this, pressing the C button in early builds of Yonsen would disable any copyrighted music that was played in game. This was later changed to the D button in a build from October 2015, then was changed into the M button sometime later. Yandere Simulator has had a ton of music removed from the game. It's a pretty long list so we'll only be going over the more notable examples. Some of the removed songs from Yandere Simulator include Apocalypse by Jesper Kidd Battle Resort from the Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire soundtrack Big Blue from the Super Smash Bros Brawl soundtrack Several variations of the Dark theme Megalovania by Toby Fox Memories of School from the Persona 3 soundtrack DK Rap by Grant Kirk Hope Until Death from the Silent Hill official soundtrack Jojo Injector Jacket by Alex Shea and The Hero by Jam Project Of course this is not a complete list of all of the removed music from Yandere Simulator To no one's surprise, there are objects that were removed from Yandere Simulator The first one is the guitar case It was used to store and transport dismembered bodies and weapons the guitar case was first shown off in the video Yandere Simulator Dismemberment and Guitar Cases, which showcased how dismemberment works. Anyway, the guitar case was soon replaced with the cello case in a later update. Yandere Dev has gone on record stating that the guitar case was, in fact, a cello case since, quote, a cello case is larger and can carry more. Basically, a cello case is the updated version of the guitar case. A group of objects, if you will, that were removed from Yandere Simulator were Gaster Blasters. The original version of the Gaster Blasters used in the Bad Time Mode Easter Egg looked like this. They didn't last for long though, as they ended up being replaced with the original models. Why was this done? Toby Fox wasn't cool with Yandere Dev using the original models for the Gaster Blasters. One may not realize it, but there are two masks that are no longer in Yandere Simulator. One of them was a demon mask that covered the player's jaw, and the other was a bad romance mask. Like the others, these masks were used to, to hide Ayano's identity during suspicious activities. These two masks were ultimately removed in a build released in March 2016. You know the vending machines that exist in game? They didn't originally look like that. In the May 24th, 2015 build, there was a placeholder plaza that contained vending machines. Neither of them were functional and only existed for decorational purposes. Needless to say, these vending machines were removed in the following build. The following removed content doesn't really belong to any specific category, so we'll just lump them together. Various versions of the student profiles were removed from Yandere Simulator, being replaced with newer versions. Some of the updated elements include new portraits, a revised layout, new stats, and a color scheme. Before March 2016, there was a warning screen that would pop up before starting the game. It acted like your typical warning screen, warning the player of everything that caused the Yandere Simulator to be marked as mature. However, the second half of the warning screen was not that serious, mentioning topics such as quote, spooky scary skeletons, standing on the edge, zombies, vampires, succubi, lewd manga, busty pink haired schoolgirls, game breaking bugs, an overworked programmer, and much worse. It was serious and not serious at the same time. This warning screen was ultimately removed from Yandere Simulator in March 2016. Why? Yandere Dev thought it was quote, cringy. With that, we have reached the end of part 2 of Yandere Simulator's removed content. If you enjoyed the video, then make sure to hit the like button and to subscribe to the channel. That being said, make sure to watch this video next.